In one word, my research is focused on pastoralism. And pastoralism is a term that encompasses livestock, the way they're managed, and the lands that they live on. But my work with pastoralism has been primarily the research in Africa. Although in the United States and here at UNH, I work with cattle and grasslands, and we don't sometimes think of that as pastoralism. I love teaching and I love working with undergraduate students. But what I found at UNH is I have time on sabbaticals or during the summers where I've received funding, um, fellowships, and invitations to do work in Africa. And I really relish those opportunities and really do enjoy doing, doing that research when I have the opportunity. My research focuses on more people than the science of pastoralism. While there's lots of science involved in growing crops, growing animals, and studying natural ecosystems, one of the things that I've done is try to focus on people and the way that they have adapted and are adapting to changes in the natural ecosystems, to changes in policies, governments, and other areas of conflict, particularly wildlife. That's one of the areas that pastoralism is often in conflict with, especially in Africa, are the wild animals that we so often think of when we think of Africa. I think before describing my work, when people think of Africa, I believe many people conjure images of wild animals, and beautiful natural ecosystems, and open grasslands. The fascinating thing is those places do exist. They are largely national parks. Those national parks were established by asking or forcibly moving pastoralists from their native grazing areas. So pastoralists in Africa have given a lot up in order to make wildlife parks work. My research has been focused on you know, how pastoralists adapt when their rangelands shrink. My research has focused on what are their other alternatives? The other thing is, uh, most recently in Namibia, I worked with um, conservancies. Conservancies are groups of people, many times pastoralists, who work together as a village or as a region, and they try to manage their resources. And those resources, in Namibia anyway, include wildlife. So pastoralism encompasses not only domestic animals, but sometimes wild animals. And for me, my research focuses on the human dynamic of managing the resource, not necessarily the science of the grassland or the soils and the plants.